I was asked to balance this equation, so let's give it a shot here. We have manganese nitrite plus beryllium chloride. So we'll use a bit of a trick to make this easier, but let's count the atoms up. We have one manganese atom, and here's the trick. This NO2, this nitrite ion, we have it here and we have it here. So we're just going to count it as one thing, and that'll make it a lot easier to balance this equation. So we have two nitrite ions here, one beryllium and two chloride ions. Product side, we have the one manganese, two of these nitrite ions here, one beryllium, and then two chlorines. So it looks like it's almost balanced. In fact, it is balanced. It's an already balanced equation. And you can see we figured that out pretty quickly by using this nitrite, this little trick here where we consider the nitrite thing one item if it appears on both sides. If you wanted to write the states, this is what you'd end up with. And so since everything is soluble here, we start out with these ions here, and we end up with the same ions. Everything stays dissolved. Really, I don't think there would be a reaction taking place here. If there was, we would consider it a double displacement reaction. But again, since they're soluble, I don't think we would have a reaction here. So type of reaction, double displacement, probably doesn't happen though. But that's it. That's the balanced equation. It's already balanced, although the reaction probably doesn't take place. This is Dr. B. And thanks for watching.